Hello, I simulated a system of double pendulum and the energy of system as well. This is a program in which we can simulate a system of double pendulum. To represent a single pendulum, I defined this pendulum class. In this class, there are four fields, mass, the length of the line connected to the pendulum, and the theta, which is angular position in radian, and omega, which is angular speed. And if you look at the system class, this is the representation of double pendulum system. In the system, there are two pendulums, P1 and P2. The class provides the, the equation of a motion for two pendulums. Also, the class provides the total potential energy of the system and kinetic energy as well. So if you want to check if the, this equation is correct or not, you can sum these two potential and kinetic energy and check if the sum is conserved during the simulation. Okay, let's run the program. The duration of calculation is one minute and the interval between each frame of calculation is one millisecond, which I consider uh, close enough. And the interval of animation is 30 millisecond, which can make 30 frames per second. This button is for starting the calculation. It, it may take a few seconds. Calculation is now done. So let's run the Result of the calculation. This is the movement of the double pendulum. You can see the movement is, the pattern of movement is totally different with the single pendulum system. And if you want to check the this movement is correct or not. You can check the energy of the system. The red line, the red line represent the kinetic energy and the orange one uh, represents the potential energy and blue line is the sum of the two energy that means the mechanical energy. You can see the blue line is constant. That means the kinetic energy is conserved throughout the simulation. This is the process to obtain equation of motion using Lagrangian mechanics, potential and kinetic energy and Lagrangians. This is two equations using Euler equation. This two equation is obtained from the Lagrange equations. To check if this 
equations are correct, we can set the length and the math of the second pendulum to zero so that we can make the system to just a single pendulum problem. So if we sub substitute L2 and M2 as zero, we obtain this equation only left. This becomes zero and this becomes also zero. So this first equation becomes like this and this equation is organized to this form which is well known single pendulum equation of motion and vice versa. So this equation is considered to be correct. And this is the final form of equation of motion. The acceleration of angle of the two pendulums. And this is the factors organized to be simple.